Welcome back. I'm doing a different... I'm actually doing a little theme, if you guys probably can tell. But I'm doing a little theme today, so as you guys saw from um, recently, I posted my unboxing of the new Powerpuff Girl collection by Colourpop. Oh my god, I almost forgot their name. By Colourpop, I got their eyeshadow palette, their glosses, and... Ooh, Sorry, I pulled everything out and I was going to pause. Their glasses and the little lick, lick, lipstick. No, they're not liquid liners. They're little pencils, the eye pencils. <clears throat> so today, if you could not guess from my nails and my shirt, I'm doing Buttercup. She's a bad bee. And I love her. I love all the Powerpuff Girls. I'm a huge Powerpuff Girl fan. Love them. So if you guys did not see that video... This palette, by the way, is like built. It's, the, it's like got a great mirror right here. And this is what it looks like. I have not used it yet. And we'll be using these. I might use one of the, like this color. But by the way, I love that it has a little indent. I'm just saying. It's going to be really hard to destroy it. Anyway. So I'm going to use the mirror from the palette because that's what I got. And it actually is. I haven't even taken the film. Oh, I did take the film. Did I take the film off? I'm not even sure. And it's super clear. This is like HD mirror. Great. So I'm going to start with crime fighting and then go on to silico, which is that green. Um, I may add a color on the outside. We will see. We will see. We will see. And I'm going to be using the Mojo Jojo color stick, which is the green one. So I'm going to go around the heart because I don't want to like. I'm a crazy person, don't want to ruin it, but I do want to add, like, just a little brown, just to get the eyelids sort of primed, you know, get, get, get it sort of primed just a little bit, just so there's, like, color, it's not going from green to whatever, and as you guys know, I'm working on my lighting, so if it goes in and out, I'm so sorry, I'm waiting ahead of time, but yeah, I was a, I was a pop of girl, girl, I literally was all of them for Halloween at one point, I had all the outfits. And I was Buttercup. I went through phases. So I loved Blossom at first because I loved pink when I was little. And then I loved Buttercup. And then I loved Bubble. Like I literally loved them all at some point in my life. So. Alright. So now moving on to Silico. 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 It's funny because I'm doing the green look and my eyes are green. And I think I'm actually going to be a crap of girl for my, for my birthday, for Halloween, because I couldn't think of what to wear, and then I have, um, my shirt, I have a pink shirt, I filmed in it before, you guys have all seen it, but, uh, I'm going to do, when I do, uh, I'm going to do all the crap of girls, as you guys have figured out, um, if you guys haven't by now, but I'm going to do all the crap of girls, and for sure do Blossom. And I was like, you know what, my hair is kind of red. I could be Blossom, I think. I'm not really bringing this color too much in my lower lash line. I don't want to get green everywhere. But I'm going to like really pack it. You know what I should have done? I shouldn't use this brush. I'm done. Okay, I'm actually going to use, sorry, maybe don't talk like how to use, I'm going to use, I got this in like a set for Batgirl, I have no idea what this is called, but I'm going to take this brush and actually pack this color sort of like onto my lid. Okay, everybody, I'm just going to pack it on, and then what I'm going to do is kind of just brush. Oh, no, I'm just going to pack it on. It's hard. It's hard for me to do green eyes. I don't know why. I don't know if it's because the green literally in my eye or what, but... And I'm trying to only use, this is really hard, but I'm trying to only use 
the colors in this palette. You can be all three powerful of girls in this palette. To me, that's like the point. That's like, you know. And I have an idea, so hopefully it's able to be accomplished. I actually came in this. I haven't tried it, but I have an idea, so. And this brush is working so much better. And I'm not even using the mirror as a mirror, sorry. It just started to get easier to look at the camera. But yeah, comment below what your favorite Powerpuff Girl is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I did green nails. Um, I used light slacker again. So the neon green is bikini bottom. And one is from, so Light Slacker came out with a uh, advent calendar at some point during Christmas. And so that's where this color is from. This color is called Elf. No, it's not called Elf. It's from Elf. Sorry, it's called Buddy, but it's based off of Elf. And then this was a Christmas one. It was... Hoping to be kissed is this one. It's a very pretty color, actually. If you're looking for a very pretty, like, Christmas green. By the way, you guys can see the mirror. Um, if you're looking for a Christmas green, you should use that one. Because it, it actually is a really cool, um, it's a really cool, uh, color. Sorry, I'm, like, not... Green always baffles me as a color for my eyes. I, I I don't know what to do. So I'm going to, it never works on me. I don't know, I can never put green eyeshadow on. So this is the eye pencil, it's called Mojo Jojo. And this is, this is the color. I'll mark it on my skin so you guys can see just like how green it actually is. And I'm going to put that on my lower line. Before I do that, let me... Sorry. I'm all over the place, guys. I haven't filmed in a little bit. So I'm going to take this color, which is Chemical X, and I'm just going to put that all over my lid. I'm not going to do Just to support the green. And make it glittery. And I put... I just added a little bit more brown in the outer, like just the rim to make it more of a look. So I'm going to take this uh, pencil, Mojo Jojo, go under my lower lash line to make kind of like a lower lash line color and make it green, you know? And then I'm going to put a wing liner. I'm going to do that all off camera with mascara because I don't want to try to do this on camera. You'll see it's actually... I can do part of it. I'm not going to use, I have a mirror set up to do this, but it, um, it glides on, as you guys see, really easily. It's actually a really easy pencil. See? That's pretty easy. I just want to blend it out and make sure it's perfect. And I can, but I just want to show you guys, see how it does glide on really easily. So I'm just going to put this in my little lash line, put a wing liner on. Put on mascara and I'll be right back to show you highlighter, lips, all that. So, give me one second. Alright guys, I'm back. I have the green liner on underneath my lashes. I have my Urban Decay mascara on and the liner. I know it's a little uneven. I'm still learning liner. I do these. I can't do the pen, the pen. I don't know. I'm not the best at it. I can try the pen. I just, I've always done better with this one. Um, and then to finish the look, there's still one more. One more finish to this eye look is I wanted to take this pressed glitter in Townsville because I feel like our buttercup, buttercup would want to add glitter. Buttercup seems like she kind of could be girly, but she's more of like a bad me, as I like to say when I first started filming. So she'd want glitter on her eyelashes, or on her, on her eyelids if she did all green looks. So now, because highlighter I'm just gonna do the same highlighter for that I've been doing a lot recently because this is one of my favorite highlighters is this is horse and carriage it is you can see it from space and I feel like if buttercup was doing makeup she'd want her makeup seen from space that's why she wears good 
so I'm just gonna put this on and this will be blinding. Um, funny enough, I wore cheetah print because to me, like, cheetah print is so New Jersey baddie that when I did it. So, this is the highlighter. It's glowing. And for lipstick, I have my primer, which is right here. You know me. I'm always putting primer on first. And then I'm going to take a more darker nude look. I'm going to take a more darker nude look. This is Ultra Matte Lip and Beeper from ColourPop. So I'm going to do that. I'm not going to do liner because this is honestly so opaque. You don't need it. And yeah, it's great. I'm going to put it on over here. So excuse me if I move a little. A little to the left. To the right, technically, for me. But I'm just going to add... To give it to this, these green, these green um, eyeshadows in the Powerpuff Girl palette. Sorry. I'm trying not to talk in the photos like at the same time. It doesn't work. And last but not least, the last thing that I got from the Colourpop collection, it came with three of the roller glosses, Buttercup, Scent, it's Green Apple, a little sour, I get it, this packaging, I'm sorry, I can't get over it, it's so pretty. So these glosses, it takes me a minute, for some reason the roller, oh, it's perfect. Oh, I don't know if you guys remember these from the 90s, like roller glasses. I have one from when they first released them. So they first released them with the with Candyland, to be minute. And I have, I don't even know what flavor I have with it. It's amazing. I put it on as Princess Wally, that's what it was. I put it on as just chapstick is the best. This rolls, sometimes it takes a minute to roll on. This rolls on a lot easier. And this is no like stickiness from gloss but it has like the juiciness like look at that hmm I feel very buttercup like and no my hair is not brown my hair is reddish my hair is sort of brown not black but you know I feel a little like I did buttercup very proud um I hope you guys enjoyed this like this was so fun for me to make I'm sorry to go off camera for the liner it would have been here this video would have been like 30 minutes, me fixing it. I did fix it a little bit, but it's... I'm working on my liner, which is why I did it today. So it'd be very buttercup-y. buttercup I guess? I don't know. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this inspiration. My homage to one of my favorite things for you, which is Powerpuff Girls. I loved it. I'm so in love that they... i so giddy that they did this collection. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, follow, all of that. Um, click the little bell on the corner. I don't know what corner it is, but click it because you'll get a notification when I upload a new video. I'm trying to do it on a regular basis. If you guys, please put down in the comments what you would like to see next. What days you like to see your videos. Anything, let me know in the comments down below. Um, thank you again for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye guys.